Experience. That was an experience. Grilled octopus there. Is it meaty? Hey, uh, this is the red snapper. I eat a little, cook a I'm little. Stressed out, yeah. Do you even have to order that here? That just showed up. Let us know how you got this car because you technically want it for free. Brian, how you feeling? We're hungry and we're here in Elizabeth, New Jersey. Before I mispronounce this, Valencia restaurant. Portuguese food. And this was a recommendation from Hugo and Ricky. They've been here a lot. What's this place mostly known for? Uh, their biggest thing is their steak on its own. It gets smoky, it gets a little smelly. I'm getting hungry listening to you. Let's go inside. Let's go. Yo, look at this menu. It's like an encyclopedia. There's like mad pages in here. Yeah. So I'm gonna leave it to the professionals. You guys already sound like you know what we're ordering. What's like the staple to get here? Well, the staple for sure is you gotta start with the red sangria. Oh, look what's coming up behind you. You don't even, do you even have to order that here? That just showed up. It just showed up. They already know. They already know, oh, they already know they, when you walk in. Know. What is this right here? Nuts, croutons, cheese, raisins. Balsamic. You know. This is off menu. Yes. So people are going to be watching this if they if they want to try it. it. What do they got to say? Let me you get that off, give me the off the menu. You got to come up with the whole menu. Yeah. Like, print it out. Passes. And you just hand it to you hand it to the whoever's serving you. There you go. In your opinion, what is the must eat here? Must have steak on stone. Shrimp and garlic a must. Sauteed octopus. Let's do a order of the crab legs. Before we dig in, salute. Cheers. Cheers. What, like what's funny is that like I've come here with friends and they're like, yo, we went back. Like, I'm not going back there unless I go with you guys. You know, like, cause you know, you guys get like you sit down and they just start bringing it. <laughs> you know, yeah, yeah, order yeah. it. Ricky, what did, what did you order for your main main course? So I got a dish that in Portuguese is called polva legareiro. So it's a grilled octopus dish. It has octopus, it's uh, peppers and onions and like potatoes, and it's kind of like all sauteed together. So it's, uh, it's one of those dishes that when you're a kid, you're kind of like, eh, I don't really like that when your parents serve it to you. But then as an adult, you're like, oh, man, this is actually really good. What I got is steak and lobster tail uh, on a stone. On a stone. So so Brian's going to be cooking his own food. Cook a I'm little. stressed out, yeah. I'm stressed <laughs> out. Another thing that there is kind of a staple in this place, not a more on the restaurant. They do it on the restaurant side, but it's more of like a special. I know where you're getting is to. The, the suckling pig. The suckling pig. Oh. Like they're known for their suckling pig. They'll only have it usually like on, on a weekends. Saturday or a Sunday. If you came in here and it's on the menu, they're going to give you a couple pieces. But if you're having a party, you could call up and order the entire pig and they'll give it to you like that. So what, what was this? This is um that's a chorizo. Chorizo. chorizo, 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 and, chorizo. And, prosciutto. and it's prosciutto. And then some um, mentango. So the chorizo we got here, this is chorizo too, right? That's just regular, yeah, dried out, and that's actually cooked over a fire. Try, so much try, try, oh, see. Ball, see which one you like better. Right. I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna say I'm gonna like this one so better because is this um garlic sauce? Yeah. I'm a, it's good with the cheese, but the garlic sauce with the um with the shrimp and the chorizo, this is fire. So right that here. sauce is actually very similar to the sauce that comes with the crab legs. Mm, so speaking of the crab legs, this is it right here. Shrimp and garlic. Shrimp and garlic. Yeah, oh yeah. Already, so. so is this the same shrimp? Kind of the same. Oh no, this same, is it's a different sauce. Different sauce. So was garlic sauce? That's a spicier garlic sauce. Mm, okay. That's the king crab legs. So regular garlic sauce, spicy garlic sauce. With sausage. And this is garlic sauce again. It's like yeah, a, it's a different, style. different style. You gotta get the baby fork and the nutcracker. This. this is just put it next to my head. Show the insides there. Man. Oh. With all that is, meat. It, is it meaty? Hey. If you really want to get professional with it, you would take this and crack it. But they cook it so well here, you really don't even need it. What's this they brought here? That they snuck um, into the table? That's definitely off menu. Definitely off menu. Avocado? Avocado? I'm pretty what sure I saw something like that on the menu. So though. that cheese that's on there is the same cheese that was on the salad. Avocado cheese and olives? Except it was, it's not crumbled. This, this shrimp's obviously different than this shrimp over here, right? Yeah. yeah. So All this right. is more like a scampy garlic sauce. Cheers to the shrimp. Cheers. Cheers. That, that's good. Mm. They're known for their own rolls. They got their own roll. This is a Portuguese yeah. roll. This is a mini, a mini Portuguese, Portuguese roll. roll. How you feeling, Brad? No, no, no. I'm Thank full you. off the appetizers. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do when this main course gets here. We didn't even get to finish the appetizers. I got the itis already. This but is what does. makes the meal this much better. The sangria is just, yeah. you just keep the sangria flowing, which but could also we be got, a problem. We got to save room for dessert though. 
Luso. Luso. It's Portuguese water. Yes. That's from a big uh, natural water spring in Portugal. Hold that, hold that combo, because look at this. All right, what's this one right here? The octopus, look at Ada's Ooh. I'm going to have some of that. One of Ricky's favorites. Oh, I thought you was really carrying two fish over there. <laughs> no, no, this is the red snapper. Yo, yes. full, full snapper. Oh, that thing's awesome. Oh, is that potato? So it's got smashed potatoes. You got your octopus right here. Check the size of that. You got your peppers and onions, some black olives that Brian don't like. Nah. And then these are, in Portuguese, they call these batatas de burro, which is... They basically they cook the potato and then they smash it with their fist. And they, so that's, <laughs> literally, how, that's how literally, they're literally made. literally they smash it with their fist. Not right? kidding. Yo, cut me a piece of that off of this. That was good. Well, go ahead, take. Right, I don't got. I don't got. I don't got a plate here. So this is just you know regular fried snapper, a little bit of lemon. It just they, they, they got their own special blend of seasoning that they put on top. Take that. Take the whole shit. You gotta eat it with your hands. If you don't eat it with your hands, you ain't eating it. You right. eat the fish with the hands? Absolutely. Wow. Some breath and garlic. <laughs> like the most basic plate that I <laughs> It looks good though. Mm. Yeah, that presentation is on point. Should we start? Oh, that's hot. I feel the heat. Yo, I feel it from here. Enjoy. Thank Chef, you, Chef Brian. I don't even know what so, to do with this. You gotta tell me what to do here. I'm gonna show you. Alright, here we go. Woo! Alright, let me back up. Let the professional do it. Alright, the steak. I'm gonna get my phone out, dude. Garlic butter. Oh. You lather it up in that garlic butter. What is that? Just the butter over there? Garlic butter. On the left. The garlic. Oh, yeah, right, just up. drawn butter for the lobster tail afterwards. Oh, so you don't, you don't put that on until it's cooked. Yeah, that's for you to dip it. That's the dipping sauce. Just an FYI, that stone is hot. I feel it right here. Oh yeah. She's brought the room down, or brought the room up like 20 degrees. You can That's, eat? I think it's done. 100 percent bro. I don't know. Do you eat lobster like half cooked? Is no, it like it's cooked, bro. It's, it's like shrimp. Sure. Gotta warm it. It cooks in like two minutes. I don't cook. Two seconds. I'm a I am an eater, not a cooker. Yeah, you can eat. You gotta multitask. You gotta eat a little, cook a I'm little. I'm stressed out, yeah. I'm stressed <laughs> out. Three sangrias in. There's a lot going on right now. And I'm looking at the sangria. I want to drink a little bit more. Like, you get hot over there, right? With all that heat. That's Sweating. what I'm saying. Sweating. Ooh. Oh. The steak is something else. Oh. Yeah. You're getting, getting burned. Splashed. Yeah. It's, it's good great. though, right? Oh, slam and dip it. Oh, get man. Get into the rice. You gotta flip it at the same time you're eating the rice. Flip it in the face. This guy really good already? eating with two forks. Look at him. This guy don't know how to act. I'm oh, this is... To be safe, I don't want to overcook those. I'm gonna take that out. I'm gonna take that away from you. Let him keep the butter. Keep, keep the, the butter. butter for you, even the garlic butter. How many ounces do you think that is? Like well, a... that's about eight ounces. That's, like, that's only eight ounces? eight ounces? No way. That's a perfectly cooked. Steak right there. Oh, what, what's this? Ten. I don't know. But it's good. Brian, Brian's already speaking cursing. <laughs> you guys want dessert? For sure. Yep. It's like the Disneyland of desserts over here. Not even kidding. Look, you got a, a Mickey Mouse over here. What's the most ordered dessert? Apple tarts. Or really? the, the pineapple upside down. Really? Because it comes with the best ice cream we're going to try. Oh. Wait, what I wanted, I don't even know if you have it. The um, creme brulee. Do you have creme brulee? Mm -hmm. Yes, I have it. Oh, right there. Surprise guest. Damn, bro. Make meet the other day. See, this is, <laughs> this is no, now, a, this, now this is like now we, we had so much food left minutes. over. I told him call the cleanup crew, but the cleanup crew came, <laughs> came after late. they packed up the food. Exactly. Come on, so now you're gonna have to order fresh food. No, no, yeah. yeah, yeah. Order... We just ordered dessert. You want the ice cream? I'm, I'm here for dessert. That's Nick from Rap Specialties. If you look at his hoodie. He's the one that wraps my race car. So this, is the, <laughs> this, is, this is the cookie cake with the graham cracker ice cream. This is the ice cream right here that everyone's talking about. What do you want? All right, so what do you what do you order? So we got this. The cookie? 
What, what's that called again? Cool Kombucha. And you got the Kombucha. And you got just the special ice cream. Special ice cream. So you want one of each? No, no more. No, I'm gonna do the flesh Yes. Oh, that's good. I was thinking about. Come on, that's, I, I, I gotta, he's I gotta, gonna give you the special lunch. I, I gotta do it. <laughs> This is this is why I like the creme brulee. You hear that? I've tried making this on my own, and this is a, this is an art to make it crunchy like this. Do you see like the um, the sugar? Uh, That's sugar. I missed the uh, sangria, so I need to do the espresso martini. Espresso martini. Espresso martini. Oh, it's actually um, you taste the cracker, like it's still um, it's yeah, still in there. It's in there. Yeah, because actually the um the chocolate's not solid chocolate. It's you know, like crunch. It's like the it's like a little wafer. I was gonna say, you know the crunchies that they use at Carvel? Yeah. But it's like a, the a bigger joint. Ooh. Oh, okay. Ooh, oh check, that, check that, check that, check that. Wow. Ooh. I was like, I was oh. wondering what you got, Nick. What is that? That's a crap. A crepe. 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 The crepe. Come on, John Gerard. Crepe. Oh man. This how fluffy it is. How soaked it is. Shake it up. The shake wetness. it up. There ain't no way. No, no way. No. Solid. That's no shape. You want me to add moist, Joe? <laughs> you want me to finger it? <laughs> <laughs> we got the layered cookie cake. Like a Portuguese tradition cake there. I Could I get? Could we get another one of these? Getting too old. Too much. You know what? No, no, no. Give me this instead. Oh, now you want you this. Now you want this. No, no, no. Okay. It's good. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. Oh, let's check that out. Nick, how horrible was that crepe you just had? Yo, I don't recommend it at all. No, horrible. <laughs> when, when the cameraman so, becomes the guy it. in front why, of the cameraman. Why didn't, you, why didn't you eat the plate? The plate? <laughs> no? That looks good. Yeah, Careful, he, he might even give it a try at this point. I'm tempted, bro. You're gonna, take, you're gonna take that to go? Yeah. Go. Might as well look yeah, at scrape, scrape the yeah. I would look that man. You need a spoon. I would, spoon. I would ask for some spoon. cookies and just soak just that all up. Use a spoon. <laughs> Ricky, are you recording? You press the record am. button? I'm, I'm recording. No, I'm, I'm, I'm behind the camera, my man. rolling. Fry, how you feeling? You look, you look like I have a baby in here. Oh, uh, yeah. The fucking one's still being just like, fuck, I just feel like this shit bulge it out. Oh, shit. All right, so we got to wake up. We're going outside. Ricky's gonna show us his daily. There's a really cool story about it. Let's go outside. Behind us, we've got Ricky's daily 2017 Civic Sport. And this car's got a really cool story and the reason why we're showing it, obviously Ricky has a crazy badass race car at the garage, but he brought his daily. Let us know how you got this car because you technically won it for free? Yeah, basically. Yeah, so I won this car. Uh, we got called by uh, somebody from Motor Trend one day that they were doing a taping for a show called Modified. They were putting on a world's greatest drag race, which if you've ever seen it before, it's one of those, you know, seven, eight car wide. Usually you see it a lot with supercars where they're on uh, an airstrip and it's a drag race for winner take all. This is when we had the blue all wheel drive EG that kind of became pretty famous on the internet. You what know? year was this? October 2017. So at that time, all-wheel drive Hondas were... Were still fairly new. And you were the only all-wheel drive Honda. I was the only all-wheel drive Honda. So it was a, so the only rule was it had to be a Honda Civic because they were giving away a Honda Civic and we didn't know this at the time. So uh, when did you find out the race was for a car? Before the race or no, after? No, after. So, so come Tuesday, we did the, we do the taping. We went, then they're doing a bunch of, you know, B-roll stuff, just getting, you know, different hand movements and launches and stuff like that. So they're, you know, after they're kind of stalling, I kind of figured, and then all of a sudden, the this car pulls up and they're like, like they're interviewing me and they're like, okay, so, you know, now we're gonna show you a prize and the car just pulls up. We're like, what the hell? You were really surprised. Real, very surprised, 100% surprised. Have you done any other modifications or is this exactly how you got um, it? New wheels got retuned at the shop. CLM tuned it with the uh, with the Honda Data Flash Pro. But yeah, this thing's a killer, man. This thing rips. It's a fun car. It's awesome to drive. I drive it every day. That's awesome. Hey, Ricky, appreciate you coming out tonight. Thanks, guys, for watching the latest episode of Fastest Food. Make sure you like, comment, share if you want to see another episode. And if you know of any cool places to eat, drop a comment or send us a DM.